actually don't exactly remember when I started smoking food. I bought a small little electric smoker and messed around with it and tried different flavors and such. I go to different places to either buy smoked fish, jerky, and it's like, boy, I like that, but I think I could do it a little bit different. And that really, I think, just ignited in my mind where I wanted to go with things. Now it's a good day. We'll get some meat in there, it'll be really good. I'm Pete, I'm Ken's butcher. Ken is a very unique individual. Whatever he does, he does it with a whole heart and soul. You are what you eat, and he, believe me, he puts nothing but the best on the table. I'll put him against anybody you got in the smoker business. <laughs> I'm an engineer. That's kind of how God wired me. And everything I do, I relate to engineering. You always look at something and it's like, well, we can make that better. We could do this, we can make this happen and so forth. Data comes in many different ways. Objective data, measuring temperatures, looking at airflow, or subjective data where I don't like that because it's too sweet. It's got too much vinegary smell. I've turned smoking into gathering data both ways with people that eat my food as well as measuring different things to see how things are. I can't separate the work side of me to the fun side of me to other things. They all blend together. I'm at the Milford Proving Grounds, and we're doing ABS testing on the GMC terrain. We're simulating going down a highway. Everything's going well. We're at 60. And all of a sudden, right in front of you, a package comes out, you turn and you do a brake maneuver. The thing you're looking for is the car being stable and no yaw where it wants to change lanes, and it performed perfectly. I always enjoy being able to get back into the product, touch the product. It's always good to ground yourself back in the hardware that we're producing. To me, professional grade means doing the best you can and achieving the highest standard with everything you do. Uh, we are getting nice bark. Oh, that meat's looking great. Oh, this is one of the reasons I get up at 4.30 in the morning. <laughs> one of the things we're cooking today is a meal for the break team. I love to cook, but what makes it so much more fun is using it as a catalyst to get people together to just have some fun. <laughs> And that to me is kind of cool that you can take a passion you have from outside of work, apply it inside of work, and everybody else is getting some joy or benefit from it. Without each and every person in the break team, we wouldn't be able to accomplish anything we do. So if me cooking just says, thanks for doing that, that just makes me happy.